everyone, I'm Kirsty, and today we're going to be watching episode 7 of Sky Castle. Our last episode ended on the cliffhanger that Yebin and Uju's mum had found the tablet that had Young Jae's um, diary that contained all his like um, thoughts on his parents and how he wanted to take his own life, how he wanted to kill his parents, how he wanted to just get out. Um, so I'm really intrigued to see what's going to be the fallout of them reading that, um, especially on Yebin's end with her mother because things are really tense between them already. So like just the thought of Yebin finding out about this, I don't know. I don't know if she'll tell it yes or something like that. Um, there's also kind of like a small love triangle going on between Yesa, Uju, and Hena, which I think could be really interesting to see um, because Yesa is clearly not used to not getting what she like. She gets what she wants, so like she wants Uju, and I don't think she's going to get him. So that'd be a really intriguing kind of thing going on there. And then we've also seen that um, Yesa's dad, Doctor Kong, is. The, his ex is Hiena's mother and I have my suspicions that maybe Hiena is actually his daughter. We'll see. Don't know. Um, but they're a similar age. Her and Yesa, so it's possible. Um, and yeah, things are just getting tense. <laughs> and I'm intrigued to see what's going to happen this episode. Um, if you enjoy my reaction, don't forget to hit subscribe. And if you'd like to leave a like or comment, I'd very much appreciate that. My socials are linked down below, including my Patreon, where you can sign up for me and receive early access to my videos. We are two weeks ahead over there, and we are also doing timers for Sky Castle. <laughs> She's like, Jesus, we need to stop reading this right now. She's not ratting you out. She's telling your mum so she's not concerned that you're out on the streets. Say thank you for looking after your daughter. Like, common decency is to say, oh, thank you for looking after my daughter who nearly ran away. Like, what? She's so rude. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. That's not normal. It's literally not normal to be stressed like that. And the way she's brushing it off is just so toxic. Like, oh, you're just stressed. You can... You can rob stores. Young Jay can write these things in a journal. Like, that's not normal. Is she telling the truth? And what does she mean by sick? Does she mean like mental illness with like depression and panic attacks? That vague wording is just. I'm glad these two are talking because maybe Han Seo Jin will finally kind of understand that she's being really oppressive to her daughter. Mm. 
She's deleting it all. But she didn't empty her recycle bin. <laughs> it's still there. <sighs> Is she going to write like a book of it all? Oh, that's a gunshot. That's a, a bullet. Oh. Young Jay's dad. I've not seen him in a while. Six years older? Ugh. What was he, like 15, 16 at this point? And she's 21? Oh. Especially with his home situation as well. I feel, I don't know, could that be called like grooming? I don't know. This is horrible. This poor kid. Oh, man. Oh, Christ, what's he doing with that gun? Why are you pointing a gun at your son? What a horrible man. What the fuck? I feel so bad for him. <sighs> that dad is actually a scumbag. Like, why? Oh. I don't even know what to say about that because that is just like horrible. Oh no, is he gonna... Oh. <sighs> this is just brutal. This is so hard to watch. Tamiso she did know though why uh, she's lying to keep up appearances I mean it's all of them all of them it's the parents the coach just all these parents are not doing anything for him. Oh, 
천만 원. 그랬다면 아예 관뒀겠지. 물론 그래서 관뒀다가 다시 욕심이 눈을 가린 거지. 그 선생한테 맡기면 무조건 서울로 내가 합격할 텐데. 그... I mean, in fairness, it wasn't her greed. It was Yesa and her mother-in-law. 네가 걱정돼서 딸을 의사 만들겠다는 욕심 때문에 알면서도 문제를 봐요. 이게 진짜 아가머리를 확 찢어버릴라. 어떻게 하당차게 훈수질이야. 야. Han Sojin is so mean to her, and she's actually just concerned about her family. Like, she actually just cares. Mm. <laughs> Oh, she's beginning to ask questions of her bestie. Go off. Exactly. That's a, such a good question. She's asking you as your friend. She's talking to you as your friend. That's what friends do. They call each other out and question each other so they make the right choices in life. What the f Han Sojin clearly doesn't see her as the like her friend in the same way. She's different, but you don't know it's not going to be the same. 수술도 참관하고 의학 논문 작성법에 대해 의사 선생님께 강의도 들었습니다. 이번 달엔 신경외과 중환자실과 CT실을 직접 견학해 볼 예정입니다. 주말마다 요양병원 봉사 활동도 꾸준히 참여하고 있고요. 물론 보고서 작성도 마지막 취하고 있습니다. 의사님도 저 쌤이 도와주셔서 더 휩쓸었는 걸요? Does she do anything that's not for getting into university? 넌 She only dropped 3 when she doesn't have the fancy tutor that you have. 당연히 올 100을 맞았어야지. 겨울점차. Oh my god. This is intense. 만족해? Um This is scary. Wow. She's really getting into her brain right there. She's like bringing Yesa down because Yesa was on like such a high being like, I'm number one in the class. And she's like, yeah, but clearly you can get to number two when you don't even have the stuff that you have. So you need to push yourself even harder. She's really getting into her brain. And she knows she doesn't like Henna. Oh. That woman is terrifying. Ugh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. No. It's not more than that, my guy. Yeah, 
<laughs> She's like, would you, would you, would you? Maybe you do. <laughs> Don't piss him off like that. That's not what you want to hear from your doctor. <laughs> quickly during lunch time <laughs> back surgery quickly during lunch time is he joking you gotta go to Huang. Dr. Huang. He'll do it. He's great. I think he's gonna go to Dr. Huang and it's gonna cause a huge stushy. He wants him to do his surgery. Not Dr. Kang. He's like, it's important to trust your doctor, but he doesn't trust his doctor. Is that his room? Oh my gosh, his room is different. A playroom. Oh, he's so mad. It's not even a playroom. It's just a room with a desk and a nice atmosphere. I think I could study in that room. Who gets motivation from a pyramid? He doesn't trust that she's not going to whip out a cup noodle. <laughs> oh, I think she's concerned about her family now. After hearing about that tutor. She wants to end the kind of war. And she wants her credit cards back. Exactly. 
She should tell her mum. That's what a respectful parent does. Mm. Oh, she is. She is going to write about him and the stress and all that. She's going to be like, who's Nuna Gao? Mm. It's very true. <laughs> so you want your hate kids to hate you as long as like you'll be happy if they get into university. It doesn't matter if they hate you. No. This guy's nuts. Like, I'm glad she went to him with her concerns. But he's just not listening. All he cares about is university. She's just concerned about her poor sons. With this crazy dad of theirs. He's so frustrating. Why do I feel like someone's going to get their eye done with that pyramid? <laughs> well, who's he going to get surgery from them? Clearly A plus. Oh no, he's <laughs> He's like, was he really you li you big liar? Wait, he actually believed him when he said that? Come on. <laughs> oh my god, this is such a farce. <laughs> He's like, what the hell is this man's angle? Not This is so ridiculous. <laughs> It's all of them. That's the real answer. Oh, 
Uchi's not gonna enter. He's gonna be her running mate. <laughs> oh no! Another time she's lost out to Hyena! Oh god. It's just so funny to me because he makes up all this stuff in his head about how Huang Chi Young sees him and all this. But Huang Chi Young is just not like that at all. He's just really chill. Who's that? In the jag. Who's picking her up in a jag? <laughs> Oh my god. Is she helping someone cheat? Oh my god. Yeah. Do you think she has a chance? No one fucking likes her. How, how, you're not. <laughs> the kids all hate her. Why, how do you think she's going to become school president? What's going on here? Oh, it's Young Jae's dad. <gasps> so he got the gun. Kim oh, he doesn't know who she is. Kim <gasps> oh. What's he going to do? Oh. It's interesting seeing people are finally kind of asking a, like some questions of the tutor and like how what happened with Young Do and Young Do happened. Like as a tutor, I like I I think she like manipulated him in such a way just to get the results, but it caused things to get even worse with his parents. I don't know. We obviously don't know the full story yet, but yeah, that's fascinating. I don't know what Young Jay's dad is gonna do now he knows who the tutor is. I he does he didn't even know who she was in the first place. Like that is so unsurprising to me as well, because like he clearly I don't know, he wasn't even arsed about it. He just cared that his son was getting results. But yeah, seeing that manipulation of Yesa by the tutor as well was really scary. Like she was just like Kenna will beat you and all this and it was just a bit ooh. that's a bit there's a lot of manipulation going on there but yeah I don't know how they're gonna manipulate it so that Yesa wins because the only way that would happen is if Kenna dropped out because <laughs> everyone hates Yesa because she's awful <laughs> But yeah, and also Uju's mum is get writing a book about Young Jae. Oh, I don't know how that's gonna go. Really intrigued to see what's gonna happen in the next episode. Um, but yeah, let me know your thoughts down below, and thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Goodbye.